Hello, I'm Sonia Wood from Oikos. Today I'm going to share with you The King's Daughter and other short stories for girls. Well, it says for girls, but why not read them to your sons as well? You might recognize the cover. Our daughter Missy designed this cover. She did a similar thing for Tiger and Tom, which is short stories for boys and the 72 short stories, um, whereby she's put on these books the title of each story, which that is within the book. The short stories here are considered to be old-fashioned character training stories. <laughs> um, I like the old-fashioned part of it. I think it is rich and valuable. Some people prefer modern, but we have gained much from this, as have thousands of other families. So that is why we share it with you. In fact, um, you might have watched some other clips that we've done about the Dr. Raymond and Dorothy Moore books that we have, that they've written. And this is what they said about it. This is one of the best selections of old-fashioned character building stories I know. I have read and reread them from childhood. And another parent, well that was Dr. Raymond Moore that said that, but this is what a parent said. I have spent literally thousands on educational and character building materials for our son and none have been as encouraging nor as influential as these old time stories. Did you notice? She said our son and they are King's Daughter stories for girls. So I think that girls and boys, moms or dads or both, read these to your sons and your daughters, these short stories. Every one of them is a lesson that is a moral or a principle or something that is going to be of value to them. In fact, once we had gone from cover to cover reading this book as a read aloud, when our daughter was in her young adult years, she had it next to her bed and she read it for herself. And then she found certain stories that were particularly of interest to her and she would reread them. And then a friend came to stay and I heard her reading the story to this friend, the one particular story. She obviously had remembered that this story was now relevant for that particular friend. So you see, it just goes on and on and on the value of spreading the seed of goodness that comes from these books and these little, these short stories. To give you an idea of the value of some of the stories, let me read some of the titles for you. There's about 40 short stories in this book. What One Lie Did, Putting Off Till Tomorrow, The Dangerous Door, The Impossible Yesterday, A Valuable Secret, Telling Mother, Duty and Pleasure, Confiding in Mother, Nothing Finished, Two Counts of Service, How She Showed She Was Sorry, Susie's Prayer, Golden Windows. Oh, I remember that story. Used it a lot in as a tool for parenting, actually. So, there you have it, the king's daughter. I hope that it's welcome in your family. Thank you for watching. Bye.